Hello everyone, the next game I'm going to show you or showcase you is my Space inv Invaders or also called a Space Shooter uh, game or clone. So here it is on, in my uh, minigames repository. You can find the source code and I'm also going to put uh, the link to this source uh, into the video description. So it has only one uh, Python file called game.py. So if you download, you need to run uh, this game.py. And it uses Pyglet, pure Pyglet, as, a, as its graphics backend. And yeah, it has about, uh, let me see, 416 lines of code, uh, including the white uh, lines or between the functions. And also it contains the resources or the res folder. And in the res folder you, you can find the zones. So there are two wave files and also the sprites used for this game. And also score the txt which just stores uh, to this the high score of the game to this file so i'm going to now show you the game itself and before i continue i just want to wanted to talk about uh, a little bit that uh, it this game was created in 2017 and after I created this game, I started to create uh, video tutorials on how to create Space Invaders using Python and Pyglet, although I never finished that tutorial series because uh, I just lost my interest. And probably this is a video series I'm going to delete from my YouTube channel and sometimes in the future because I don't like uh, when something, something is not finished or uh, and I also don't like its quality, I mean the video quality. So um, now I'm going to show you the game. The game is already uh, exported or uh, to an exe file using PyInstaller. So I did this because uh, I wanted to send this game to my friend to him to try out and it has only one exe file and the rest folder. So after you die, it, it just shows you the game over screen and also you can reload the game by pressing the R. And here on the right side are stored the, the stat, stats or how many enemies was destroyed, so 244. The score was 220, the player health is of course, it starts at 5 but now it's, it is 0. And uh, now if I reload the game, it will load this score because it is bigger than the high score, which is 120. So let me show you. And now, as you can see, it shows that 
the new high score is 220. And this new high score is now stored in the rest folder in, in the score.txt. So as you can see, it is 220. And later, uh, this year, so in 2019, I already started to actually port. Uh, so this is a prototype. So it is not still not uh, entirely finished. But uh, later this year I started to redo this game using now the Lua programming language and the default uh, engine. I'm going to show you the that version as well. So I am now in the default uh, game engine. So it is default editor version editor version 2.0 and default engine is written in the C uh, as I know and you can program the AI or the game behavior using the Lua language and I think the the editor itself so I mean the GUI editor is written in Kotlin but maybe I am wrong so I'm going to run this version and yeah, I just created a new type of enemy, which is much bigger. I used Anim Studio to actually create this uh, animation, and it can take uh, eight or ten uh, shoots before before he dies or it dies it is still in early development so it will take a little bit more time to actually finish this because i have of course daily work so i don't have enough time to make these games i'm working on these not just on these but uh, i have many more other projects and i'm working on these games mainly but at the weekend, but not uh, not all weekends. I think um, in default the games the game is running much smoothly than in Python and the Pyglet version. So it's a nice engine. I mean this the default engine. If you want to try out. And of course, if you want, I can create some default videos. I, I mean, some kind of an introduction to the default engine or how to create a space shooter or space invaders clone in default engine. So if you want uh, this type of video series, then uh, just comment in the video section. And if I have enough time, I'm going to create a series like this. Whenever this game gets finished, probably I'm going to show you, so create a video about uh, the default version of, of my space shooter. And I'm planning, planning also to upload uh, my other source codes to GitHub uh, for my other games, so I'm also going to create video demonstrations about those games as well. So until then, thanks for watching and have a nice day.